What's up, YouTube? This is Galacticod, and welcome to another episode of Did You Know? The series where we take a look at weird, fun, quirky facts about the game we all know and love, known as Yu-Gi-Oh! Now, did you know that due to American program regulation, the design of the dual monster cards had to be changed so that they were not identical to their real-life counterparts? Because if the fictional cards looked the same, the show would be categorized as a commercial. So the cards were changed because we all know that the show of Yu-Gi-Oh! is all based on the story and not about promoting cards like a giant commercial. Now did you know that in Season 1, Episode 52 of the Yu-Gi-Oh! GX series, when Zane's card from a different dimension returns to his hand and is activated, he and Jaden both draw two cards. We see that Jaden draws Miracle Fusion and Defusion. He later plays Miracle Fusion, but soon after ends up with no cards in his hand. What happened to the Defusion? Jaden didn't play, set, or discard it for the rest of the duel. Also, had he still had it during the last turn of the duel, he could have used it to defuse Zane's Cyber End Dragon, ultimately winning the duel. No wonder Jaden is stuck in the Slifer Red dorm at the Duel Academy. Now there is a theory that all number cards are connected in one way or another to that of number 39 Utopia. One of the more well documented cases comes to us with the fact that number 92 is the aftermath of number 53, but did you know the difference between 92 and 53 is 39, which of course is the number of Utopia. Is this merely a coincidence, or is it a Konami conspiracy? Now did you know the Cyber Dragon has been printed in every rarity of Yu-Gi-Oh, except Ghost Rare? I believe this is because machines don't have souls, thus they can never really be a ghost. Now Blackwing Gale the Whirlwind was the first tuner monster that Crow summoned on screen, but did you know that it has the same attribute, level, and attack as the first tuner monsters that both Yusei and Jack summoned on screen as well? Those being Junk Synchron and Dark Resonator respectively? Now did you know that Jaden actually dueled Yugi in the Yu-Gi-Oh! GX anime series? The fourth season of the show was never aired on screen outside of Japan, but in the final episode of the series, Jaden battles the King of Games himself and is ultimately defeated by Slifer the Sky Dragon. Poetic justice considering Jaden belongs to the Slifer Red Dorm. Alright, that's going to about do it for this episode of Did You Know? Remember to let me know any kind of weird, funny, quirky facts about Yu-Gi-Oh! you may know down in the comment section below. And I guess that's it for now. This is Black the God, out.